Hey guys, what's up? It's me, Sarah. So today's vlog is just going to be kind of random. I took a nap in the middle of the day. I don't know why I do that because now it's like 1am and I can't sleep. So I am going to color my hair with this nice and easy color product. Um, so yeah, I really hope it's nice and easy. I hope it's not awful and terrible and hard. So we're gonna, we're gonna see how this goes, guys. Guys, so like this is probably not the proper way to do this. <laughs> the smell, this is so potent. I probably don't dye your hair like I do. It's totally, totally cool to curl your hair with the straightener the way I do. Probably don't color your hair the way I do. I'm gonna see how this turns out. All right, so now I have the color all in my hair and kind of like all over my head and my neck too. So that's a bonus of coloring your hair at home. You can also color your entire skin too. Or you could be careful and like put a towel on, but I didn't do that, so it's okay. It's no worries. I did wear the shirt. I wear the shirt every time I color my hair, so I don't get color completely all over my body, just, you know, on my neck and my face, so I can either, I hear cat. <laughs> Kitty, baby, no, 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 no. So I can either Put a lot of makeup on tomorrow and wear my hair down. Or I just sport my new look. It doesn't really matter. I'm not too concerned about it at all. So, yeah. I'm hoping. The goal here is to cover up the red. I'm trying to go back to brown. I really don't know if that's going to happen. But we're going to try. And whatever it ends up as is my new hair color. So, it's all good. We'll see how this turns out. Hey guys, so it's the next day. My hair is so dark, there's still red in it, but I think it's really pretty. I'm really happy with it. The box said that it was going to be a medium brown. This is not medium brown. But, I mean, it lived up to its name. It was nice and it was easy. And they gave you this conditioner that you put on like after you wash out the color. And it made my hair feel really, really soft. So I'm pretty pleased with that. So I'm wearing so much makeup. I usually don't wear this much makeup. I don't even know what I did with my eyeshadow. It's like several different colors on it. I was trying something new. I intended on covering up the hair dye that's on my head and that's where it started. And then I just came up with this whole face of makeup and this is so not me, but that's okay. I'm not glued to it. I can wear no makeup tomorrow. I can wear makeup today. You don't have to do the same thing every time. You can change it and it's fun. So yeah. So I'm gonna go do some things. I might not wear the sweater. Do we like the sweater with this dress? Actually, I think I do. It's not even a sweater. It's like a cardigan type thing. It's like a towel-y material kind of. I think it's for the beach, honestly, but it works. It's 77 degrees here today. It's sunny. It's beautiful. But I'm actually, I'm ready for fall, which is weird because summer is my favorite season usually, but I'm like so excited to wear boots and sweaters and scarves and leggings and drink pumpkin coffees. I think maybe I'll have some pumpkin coffee. I think I'm going to do that. So anyways, guys, I'm gonna run. I gotta go to the bank because it's very important to have your finances in order. Like, 
I try really hard. I'm not the best at it, but I try really hard. Maybe one day I'll do like a how to get your finances in order vlog, but that's not today. I have two bags, two, two bags of shoes. I have to go donate because last night I went through all my shoes. I went, I went to Ollie's and I got a shoe rack because I'm like, I really need to organize. Like I'll show pictures of the before, the during and the after. And like, there's all these shoes everywhere that I've just been like walking around. So I'm like this. is ridiculous like this needs to end so I bought a shoe rack I built the shoe rack and then I'm like okay well I might as well go through the closet too I opened the closet and all these other shoes probably all the shoes that I've like bought in my entire life after my feet stopped growing were in my closet like I never got rid of them because I I buy shoes, but not that many shoes. So. It was a lot of shoes. So I'm gonna donate like two bags of shoes. Matt, I love going through my stuff and donating it. It's a great thing to do. People ask me, why don't you sell them? Some things I sell, but most things I just donate because I want someone who doesn't have them to like, get them. We have to be generous with what we have. Like That's super important because if we're not generous, then we're selfish. And if we're selfish, then that's not a good kind of heart to have. You gotta have a giving heart. We all deserve the same things in life and we don't all have the same things, so. I like to give what I can. I I like that, so. Everyone else should do it too sometime. Try it, it's awesome. I gotta go, so I'll be back later. Be back later. Hi guys, so I'm home now. My sister's coming over in a little bit. So we're gonna have family night, which I'm excited about. You gotta meet her though, because she's super cool. She's my big sister, we're like this, so I love her. I wanna tell you about my necklace because I don't know, maybe some of you are wondering what that is for. I can't remember where I got my necklace, but it's for Philippians 4.13, is I can do all things through him who gives me strength, or him who strengthens me, or Christ who gives me strength, whichever version you are reading of it. There's lots of different versions, but pretty much it's, you know, all my strength comes from God. And I love this necklace. It's so special and it's so true. And I think it comes into all of our life. You know, sometimes in life, like you don't feel like you're like the best version of yourself, or you don't feel like you're as strong as you could be, or courageous as you could be, or whatever. You doubt yourself, whatever. You know, your mind plays plays games on you but the good news is like when you feel you don't feel strong enough you don't have to be because where you are weak he is strong he makes up for that when you feel like you're not courageous he will give you courage there's been so many times in my life where I'm like eee, I don't know about this but like God has got me through because he makes me stronger so that's that's a good bible verse if you haven't heard it look it up it's pretty great so I just wanted to share that with you. Philippians 4.13. Guess who's back? It's me, Chewy. It's Chewy. We're going to Ulta. We're going to see if they have the new Ariana Grande perfume because it came out last week and they didn't have it. And it came back several times and they still don't have it. So we're going to see if they have it. The mall closes in like 20 minutes. So we are, we're those people. Oh, well. Smile. Oh, it's so coconutty. It smells so good. Hi, guys. Look at we got 
What's this? A milk? Make milk? 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 A milkshake. Mmm. I got strawberry, and should we got vanilla? I don't think I've ever had a make milk shake before. Am I saying that right? A make milk shake. A make shake. <laughs> They're so yummy. They're so good. And we got fries. So yeah, that's pretty much the end of this vlog. I hope you guys had fun. I hope you enjoyed it. Bye. We smell like coconut. We do. The whole car smells like coconuts. It's amazing. It's amazing. Oh. <laughs> what movie is that from? So Undercover. So Undercover. It's a good movie. It's funny. You guys should watch it. Have a good night. Bye. Bye.